welcome back to another video. Today we're playing always, sometimes, mostly. Um, I don't have anything to say about it, but okay. This is an RPG game, by the way. What are we doing down at the zoos? Stop. Wait. I'm the boss, so you don't make a move until I tell you what to do. Got it? I thought you told... <clears throat> okay, this is off to a great start. I'm not speaking properly English today. Okay, I thought I told you already. Once I'm paid, then we're done. I'm... Oh my god. Can this like have voices by itself? <laughs> I don't need you controlling me anymore. <sighs> no, you ain't finished working yet. There's plenty of people I still need killed. Wait, are we on a killing machine here? You don't get to say anything. Oh wait, wait, what? You don't get to say anything until I decide you're done spilling blood. Why are we killing people? You check that privilege at the door when you're signed up for this job. Here I make the rules. Here I decide what happens. That's what you signed up for, right? I don't know, did I? Oh, okay, we're moving. Um, oh, God, what do you want now? Hey, what did I just tell you? You ain't going anywhere unless I say so. What else I can look at? Well, we didn't... Whoa, who's that? Woo! Yeah, I'm telling you, you're making this big. Don't do anything. We'll all be good. Well, okay then. I'm going back. See ya. Okay, I can't go back. Well, if there's more money you want, all you gotta do is ask for it. Name your price, I'll pay. Whatever it takes to knock some sense back into your head. I don't want any more money. I already have more than I need. Why can't you understand why someone might not want to do this anymore? I wouldn't want to do it in the first place. Okay, let's go see this person. Oh god, it's a homeless person. Excuse me, sis. I can, who, wait, is this a man or a woman? Got a minute or a dollar? Hard times all around. Oh, shit. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm giving him an Australian accent just because I can. Smelly vagabond fuck. Get the hell out of my way. We don't have anything for you. Oh, I've heard that one before. Oh, wait. Wait. Oh, that's one. Oh, I've heard that before. Probably for you, too. Different a uh, different street. Who knows? Maybe we sh used to know each other before. Okay. Hey, can you imagine that? Warned to not pee again. I'm changing the voice for some reason. I'm trying to find a good voice for that person. God damn, Shinzo. Are you fucked in the head? Yes, mentally. Get the hell out of my way. Right, we gotta things move along. Before you go, there's something I think you ought to take a look at. Oh, it's a gun. Well, you might have expected you. Does it feel familiar standing on this end of the barrel? Or do you feel more comfortable with your own piece of trunk? Go ahead. Oh, wait. Hey, I have a gun. When did I get that? That's right. Aim it right between my eyes. What the hell do you think you're doing that job? What do I want? I like playing games, don't you? Yeah, I love playing games. That's what I'm playing right now. What do you say to giving mine a bit of spin? I, oh wait, what voice did I give him? Crap. I don't want this fool smoking. Oh wait, I don't know what this fool smoking, but if he doesn't pull that gun down right now, I'll pull it, put a hole in his head. I give him like a dark voice of mine. Of course. 
see you hurry I will sit down if you like. We can all be done with it if you wish. Why well, can't use this matters anyway? I want to tell you a story though, about how many choices we will make. At the end of it, you can decide what- Oh shit, I skipped it up accident. The only rule in the game. Let me finish, no interruptions. Then the choice is yours. Or, we can pull the trigger right now. Sounds a lot less consuming, doesn't it? Either way, the choice is yours. What should I do? I think I'm gonna listen to him. Because I don't want to shoot people. I don't even know this person. <laughs> if you won't put that gun down, fine. Talk fast. There are many roads between yours and mine. Wait, is this her talking? Him or her, whatever? But all the roads start from the beginning. Or forever, or something like that. I didn't get to read it. <laughs> dragged to a party by someone? What if that party was life itself? Led by the nose, barely wanting to take part. Do you ever have the choice not to go? If you would like something miraculous to change you. But would you know the opportunity when it knocked? No, no I wouldn't. Fair weather friends are sometimes hard to sort. A man with opportunity to spare knows his place. One such man of opportunity threw a party. He was looking for someone special, important. Not a lover, not a friend. He was looking for someone of substance. A uh, family member? Whether it was the right choice or not, still up for debate. That night, they toasted ambition, success, and more. Little did they know how steep the mountain was. Is that like pulling up a song here? Oh, it brought light. Oh, I'm controlling this dude now. Okay. Come on, hurry up. Or did you change your mind? Oh, I can't do a girl's voice. Rip. And there's so many girls here. You can't invite all these people over here and leave them to take library. Take care of them, Larry. Oh, so this guy's name is Larry. They're all weird. Why can't you have normal friends? Oh. They all work here. Oh, wait. Since it's me, I'm going to just do my voice. They all work here. They all work there. They're all f friends. Writers, artists, wannabes. You know, like the ones I was telling you about. Boss wants me to sign someone by next week, but I still haven't gotten a clue where I'm looking for. What I'm looking for. Well, just pick someone who's going to do the good job. I don't want you getting fired over some fuck up. This apartment's way too nice for that. Yeah, okay, you gave me tea. Hey, is that my girlfriend? Great party, Larry. We're glad I can make it. Well, I'm glad you're here, too. Did I tell you this red wine I found? Give me a second. I'll get it some for you. I can toast. It'll be great. The wife says I can't have any more that one night. Then again, I took her up for a good privilege. Maybe later. We won't toast, because the wife, you know. <laughs> Maybe later. Gotta see who else is here. Okay, I can just use this. Hey, Larry. Congratulations on the new job. Thanks. It's been a long coming. Long time coming. So you're telling me he got a new job because he got fired from his old one? Hmm? Yes, maybe. Okay, you like my new lighting? Got a new light for my room. So I can actually record properly. Okay. Enough rambling on. Well earned it, though. What 
do you say to toasting? Oh, God. You've got this gin you want to polish off. Taking it easy tonight. Only one drink. Gin is this. Sounds like a good choice, though. Maybe later. Maybe later. Gotta see what else is here. So is it all gonna come down? Let's go talk to a guy. Let's go talk to this hipster looking dude. Hey, hey, Larry. I see you got a car, a cat running around you like it owns the place. How come you told me? How come you told me I didn't bring, couldn't bring my dog? Firstly, I have no idea whose cat that is. Since the last time you brought the dog, I've cons, I considered me, wait, what? No, cornered me and wouldn't stop barking until you fed them those donuts. <laughs> Don't worry, dude. They used to hate me too. That's because they like assholes, Justin. Larry, I think they just smell you for you. Next time, I'll let you feed them the donut. And I get to talk to him. Larry. There you are. Help us that a little bit. Why does he look British? That's why I'm gonna give him a British accent. Dude, he's not liking it. He's not going to like it. Are you guys talking about the game thing again? All we want to know is if you ever play a game, where would you might not wind up being a hero? Oh, oh, oh god, we have four choices. A game where I might not be a hero? Sorry, I had to turn the volume because it was quiet. Well, it depends. It depends, actually. Well, I guess it all depends on the situations. I see you told people we would love us. Oh, that's one opinion. Plus, Larry doesn't count. No offense. None taken. <laughs> Let's go talk to Party Woman. Actually, you know what? Hold on, can I save? Oh, I can't save. Okay. Let's go check out this piece for uh, Okay. Okay, let's talk to... Let's talk to this one. Larry, congratulations! I heard you got the new job. Well, there's a lot of, to do. Nonsense. Let's toast for your success. I can interest you in some white wine. I'll only be having one drink tonight. White wine does sound like a lovely meal. Sure, why not? Alright, next drink. Give me a second to run the patio. There's someone I want to, you to meet. Always happy to meet the baller chain. Oh, I didn't get to talk to the rest of them. Oh, don't go anywhere, Larry. I'll be back for the patio before you know it. Can I talk to... Oh! Now I get to be them. Ah! Uh -huh. Oh yeah, I'm using my controller, by the way. Okay. Oh, there's more people to talk to. I'm assuming the white wine's over here. I'm not even gonna bother talking to everybody. I could use another beer, but I have to find my baby first. Larry's waiting for me. Your baby? So, does that mean I have to talk to everybody? Whoop. <gasps> Whoa! Such a good drawing. Whoa. Love boobs. They all look empty to me. This guy looks like him. Hey, did you get a chance to talk to Larry again? Yeah, I just spoke to him. I gotta go, though. He's waiting on me. Oh, so I have to pick someone. Oh, I knew it was him. That's amazing. What are you waiting for? This is the perfect opportunity to bring up that book you and Sam were talking about. Do you think Sam would mind me pitching out a book of own? I mean, I'd be a kind, kind of, yeah, kind of pissed if I was left out in the mischief. <laughs> Make a distinction. I don't know how to spell that. Oh, crap. I am bad with English. 
Sorry if I pronounced it wrong. You can worry about that later. If you don't get in there and butter up him up, now you will too old to be drafting and take it from him. I guess you're right. We got to take it back. Come on, you got to give. Shh, you forgot sign card. Here, give it to me. I'll sign it first. Oh crap! What's her name? Oh my god. Let's go with Natasha. No, you know what? We're gonna put us. We're gonna name this person Natasha. Not. Oh, have I spelled that right? Okay, my turn. Okay, we're gonna call this guy. We're gonna name this guy Bill. Crap. Yours truly, Natasha and Bill. Let me just see that for a second. Sounds perfect. Alright, Bill, let's go. Wait. Kiss me first. Good luck. Oh god. Oh, that was such a good intro. Always. Mo sometimes. Monsters. Okay, that was just the intro. 16 minutes in. They did a really good job. Love it. Wow. Okay, that's not so literally before we tell the story. Let me guess. You've got a book you wanted to mention. Just hear me. No need, Natasha. There's a reason I'm so scared of you. I've seen your stuff. You got talent. A lot of potential. But you're rough. I want to put a good word in with the boss. See if I we get you in advance. That's that's crazy. Seriously. Thank you so much. I'd like you some time. I'll get you something to show him in the morning. This is so exciting. So To the world domination. Oh, it really didn't matter who set things in motion. The land slide has started long before the night. This version of the story needed a hero, though. Would this be the one? Yes. I don't know. I can get rid one year later. One year later, y'all. SpongeBob reference. <laughs> One eternity later, y'all. Oh, shit. Well, that's not good. I didn't get to read that. Lazard Destroyer Team, Chad Thompson, Keith Thompson, Sharon H oh, I didn't get to read the rest of that. Choice is elevation of cost and benefit. Circumstance dictates the evolution. Consequence takes care of the rest. Well, life lesson. In this system, there is no right or wrong. Tubs down apart. Oh, I get to play as her. What time did I get in last night? Shit. Looks like my pee bill sleep monitor got reset. I gotta get to sleep where this thing tells me to. I was halfway to earning my one month circuit day and master sleep achievement. Let me just go through the box and reset this thing. There we go, all set. 
disabled on this journey starts with a single step. Nice. All I've got is those pizza pouches. You took three pizza pouches. Cooking directions. Place in the microwave for two minutes. Let cool for 30 seconds. Sure beats eating them frozen. I'd say. Jeez. Oh, well, that's where I put that dollar. You found one dollar. A bunch of old dusty books. Looks. Oh, wait. <laughs> I'll let never read. Dirty clothes are at least my concern right now. Or my least concern right now. I've been wearing the same clothes since college. Any change now? I've been, okay. There's a lot to do right now. Probably not a good time to sleep. Turn off lamp. Turn on lamp. Good. What shall I microwave today? Oh, whoa. Nothing, I don't want to microwave anything right now. Okay. Oh no, I forgot to... This is the bathroom? Another day in life, I suppose. Oh, chills, man. No, I didn't want to go back out. I didn't want to go back out. Take a shower? Sure. Listen to that calming music. Nice. Refreshing. I might change my voices right now. Looks like there's a few notes under my door. Adden, tenant of apartment 104. Your rent has not been received as of this notice. As a result, and according to your lease, this bit balance must be paid immediately or you will be evicted on the convention of your landlord. Your current pay balance is $500. This entire balance must be paid immediately to avoid further action. This is a serious matter and your attorney in action is required. Failure to act on prompt fashion will <laughs> fashion will leave you responsible for additional charges such as court and attorney's fees. Your credit rating must be also be uh, may also be affected. Please speak with building management as soon as possible to avoid further issues. Sincerely, management. Thirty days overdue. Pay up, deadbeat. Oh God, it's always something, isn't it? Come to see if you wanted to get coffee. Best work at the Phoenix. But you are asleep. Don't be late, man. I vo- <sighs> Wait, what? I vouched for you, and my manager hates slackers. At least I've got a job for today. You've grabbed your apartment key. You've grabbed that good. Alright, we're going out. Hey, it's an old granny. These lamps don't even work. This building is a joke. Look through keyhole. May as well take a look. What a lovely fake cactus. And it's making it with real flowers. What the heck was that? A stuffed old granny. Where is it? I know it's behind here. It's in here. Excuse me, Miss Twellinger. Oh, pardon me, Natasha. Am I in your way? I got it. 
so distracted looking through my, through my purse for my little calendar. There's never enough time in the day, do you, you know? Look at the time, I don't really have time to chat. The landlord's hunting me for this monthly rent and I got to sleep before it catches me. Where's your boyfriend? Things uh, didn't work out. It's just me, you know. That's a real shame. You're such a nice kid. Kid. Call me kid one more time, bitch. Call me kid one more time. Oh crap, I didn't read that. Whatever happens to this book, you sold. Did you not make any money? Still haven't finished it, but I'm working on the checks for the page publisher. Who knows? Maybe I'll get lucky and it'll finally be in my mailbox today. Well, that's just awful. You tell what you do, and if you need mo oh wait, I'll tell you what. If you need money, you can come up to my place later, and I can help clean up a little. I'm hosting a little get together tonight, and police needs to be spotless. I'd love, I'd be lovely to help. I'll think about it. But I suppose you spend the day getting help in my friend. Maybe I'll come by and see if I talk to you. If you got plans, don't worry about it. Oh, my door will be open if you change your mind. Have a good day, Natasha. I hope you find what you need. Alright. Let's take the elevator. Oh, okay. Cheap ass landlord. That's like been a problem for months. Turn on the light. Nice. You found indie heroes figure number 42. 24, sorry. Name, sorcerer. Uh, delivers job. Pro drop, 2014. Oh, this is a pretty unremarkable plastic flowers. Sounds like the landlord's on the phone. I might be able to slip out if there's any detected. Open up the box? Sure. Look inside the box? Sure. Nothing in there. Cool. Oh, God. Crap. I can really help you save your land. You can do a lot of trouble, punk. A whole month late in your rent, and I'm not in the business of sheltering dickheads. Yep. Are you going to pay me what you owe, or am I going to have to toss your ass out to the group? You serious about a victim, me, huh? Don't worry about it, man. You know I'm going to be. Alright. I'm expecting a check from my publisher real soon. They're probably busy here, so just relax. Look, the check's going to be here soon. It's gotta be here soon. Just give me and tell them when the mailman's been delivered, okay? I don't care about my I don't care how many tricks you gotta turn out of Harry. You're out of time, hood rat. Pay me tomorrow by the end of the day, or you can consider yourself officially homeless. In fact, you know what? Hand over your key right now. You can get it back from me when you pay your bills. Hey, Barry, you think you're going? I told you to hand over that key. Did it give you the key? But I think I have it on somewhere. You hand it over to the apartment key. Come see me when you've got the money, and I'll get it back to your room. See you later, Tippy. Well, fucking asshole. I've been done for the end of the day. I can do. Th I can do this. I've already got work from the Phoenix, or I can go help the smuggler. Time to get to work. That way, do any day. Wow, harsh. Dumpster.
waiting. There we go. Some steps. Hey, Natasha. What's going on, girl? I'm good, Billy. Hanging around like usual, I see. Got no need to walk around here. I can see the whole city from right here. Sounds productive. Well, I've got Axel. I think we'll want some five hundred dollars by the end of the day, and I don't know how long we'll get. Dang, that sucks. Well, I'm broke, so I can help you with cash. I did find this rare indie hero figure in the trash this morning while I was taking the breakfast. It's probably worth a few bucks if you want to pull it off, or you can just try getting all of the six if you know like me. I'm a bit shy. Thanks, Betty. At this point, anything else? If you ever get lost, come see me. I know these streets at the back of my red girlfriend. Oh god, there's so much to explore. Hey, phone. I can go in here. Cap from the Vagabond Dogs. Hit arcade game for Gold Launcher at Toronto. Hey there, Nigel. Do you work here? Uh, no. I just kind of walked in. I've been looking for guys that run this. I've heard they've got a neat little game idea they've been making. Yeah, I can't help you with that. I'm just passing by. It's the room wandering into the building. I can't Probably down in the coffee shop. If there's anyone that's certain in life, it's been getting developers love coffee. Oh god. So many voices. I mean, who doesn't love coffee? I don't have time to look at all this crap. I'm already 32 minutes in. Or would. Right, we just need to get to where we're going. Let's go talk to this dude. Hey girl, you marrying my bride? Yeah, it's a pretty sweet joke if you got it. Why so? Maybe we could take it for a spin to get it sometime. Yo, hit me up, please. I gotta go. Hey, hey. Welcome to the Dirty Dawn's popcorn stand where I sell fresh popcorn and absolutely nothing else. So you have it. So have you ever heard of the popcorn trick? It's where you take a bag of popcorn and you cut a hole. Well, the popcorn trick? Let me stop. You right there, Dirty Dawn invented the popcorn trick. In fact, it used to be called the Dirty Dawn Maneuver. What happened? Why the name change? Man, it's a long story. Let's just say there was a year-long legal battle with the Dirty Sanchez guy who I was forced to rename it the popcorn trick. Well, if you ever think about it, the name actually makes more sense now. Yeah, I guess you're right. Thanks, kid. You made my day. Dick's Pawn Plus. <laughs> my job is complete garbage. I've had to stand around all day doing nothing at all. Sometimes we don't even know about it. We don't even have customers. That's just the bacon burn. Let's go see Charlie's. Charlie, Charlie, are you there? Sleeping in your underwear? Alright. Can I get one of these? Nobody ever carries my favorite ice cream flavor. When will I be when the world respect the noble thing gentle? How to win back the man with the dreams in ten easy steps. Boy, some people sure are disappeared. I don't know, I was about to say that word right now, I've had a brain fart. Okay. Man, this light makes my face more white. Alright. Damn, these prices are outrageous. Someone ought to pay, take a baseball bat to this place and do some in price adjustment. Wow, I have one dollar. 
that one dog and do me. Hold on. You. You. Oh, man. Kind of makes me look green on my neck. Let's go see what we're doing. Loctite, I guess. I don't want people stealing scraps. Hey there, pretty lady. Got a second to invest in the sandwich? I'm trying to focus on the sandwich. I haven't eaten in at least seven days. Let's go see what this guy's up to. He looks like a badass. I love to go just one day without some idiot randomly annoying me. Okay. Sorry about that. This is one of the hottest club. Hottest dub in town. Oh no, I got a right club. In town. I've been lined up all day long. I'm not moving for anything. Hey kitty. You look like you got a whole good taste. What do you think of my new dress? Cost me a fortune, but I think it's hot. That's gray. It looks gray. Definitely worth the money on a body like that. The hell are we doing? Like fucking gay sexual ass and shit? Oh, I like the way you talk. Oh, God. My name's Haley, by the way. So I was looking for someone to do me a favor. I don't see why I couldn't be you. Well, that all depends on what you need. You know Dirty Don over by the pawn shop. I hear he's giving me tabs, happy pills. I think he calls them. That makes me feel like I'm having the most orgasm. Big sex. With God. Sounds intense. If I had to give you $50, could you pick up one for me? I know it's silly, but I don't want to lose my place in line. Deal, bitch. Alright, deal. How many pills should I ask for? That should get you by 10 pills, so bring them all back. I might have even share one with you if we party later. Okay. Sounds easy. I'll be right back. Wait, there's one more thing. Dawn's got a trust issue. You gotta meet this. Can I give you a sealed envelope? Oh, what's this? It's a little message for me, Dan. You know, to prove you. You're cool and not a cop and all that, right? Well, obviously. Keep it sealed, and uh, you see him or he'll be suspicious. Well, you get there, open it, and read it out to him. Simple stuff. Gotcha, you have fun waiting in line. Okay, we have to go to Dawn. Hey, welcome to Dawn Popcorn Stand. Are you selling anything else? So I've got this envelope from the girl I'm supposed to see in this store. Well, what are you waiting for? Open the damn it. You open the sealed envelope, it says. Well, go on, read it. I like big, but I think. Oh, 